We are here at the Cornerstone Cardiff, which is hosting a Vintage Kilo Sale event today. We are here with Emily, the event uh, organizer, and we are going to ask her a bunch of questions about if the uh, vintage sale industry as a whole will help or hinder the impact the fast fashion industry has on the environment. All the stuff that we're selling is uh, vintage, secondhand, or branded. Um, so we've got stuff from the 70s to the noughties, all sorts of different types of stuff. It normally happens about three times a year um, in Cardiff. We do events there every single weekend, pretty much, throughout the year in different cities. So we are just trying to bring affordable and sustainable ways of shopping to loads of cities around the country. I think it's a really good alternative to buying fast fashion stuff. I think the younger generation are trying to move away from fast fashion brands. I think they're being more conscious about what they're buying, and buying secondhand is proven to help the planet and the carbon emissions. Um, it means you're not buying something and then wearing it once and then throwing it away. You're buying something that's better quality, has already had a life, um, and then you're giving it another life. So I think it's a really great way of helping people have an alternative. There's, we get thousands of customers through each week who are choosing not to buy fast fashion stuff, so there's only going to be a decline in the need for supply for all these fast fashion things. People are going to want to buy stuff that's going to last a bit longer because it takes a lot to make clothes. I mean, even to like, grow the cotton to make the clothes is a lot. So I think the popularity of us and the, the massive push at the moment across everything, everyone's trying to be sustainable and more eco-conscious. I think we're just going to get more popular and I think fast fashion brands are going to have to rethink what they are providing. Um, but yeah, people can come and get stuff from us all the time. <laughs> As more and more vintage sales are appearing in the UK, only time will tell if this is going to help the problems of fast fashion. This is Yilian Liang with CUTV News.